Um, uh, On the political side of this, Carl, the Biden team has said two things already, okay? So we know Joe Biden, as president, will speak from the White House after the trial is concluded. And now we're getting word for the first time that these surrogates will speak outside the courthouse. What sort of strategy do you see there, and could it be effective? Well, uh... I, I assume the strategy is to go and trash the former president, and I think it is premature and a mistake uh, because I think people, uh, the, the people who are up for grabs in this election who have not settled into one camp or the other, I think are going to be impressed with letting the process flow out and finish before it's jumped on by politics by either side. So I think this is a mistake. On the other hand, what they may be thinking is this. Let's keep this in mind. This is the framework that all of these decisions are being made in. This election comes down to six states. The Great Lakes states where it is tight. Six states. The number six. I am French Shy Pierce and welcome to French Shy Blue. The six states that he has on here are Michigan, Pennsylvania, Wisconsin, Arizona, Georgia, and Nevada. Michigan is the 26th on the list. Pennsylvania is two. Every number here represents when that state came into the union. The total is 146. 146 minus the calendar year 366 with the leap year comes down to 22, 220, 220. Now, when we're dealing with the 2 2, remember I told you Barack Obama sweated a V on his forehead and I pit go to. The 22nd letter of the alphabet is V. This girl had V's allegedly in her head braided when Trump, when um, Obama was here in Chicago at a grammar school for Christmas playing Santa Claus. And on the marker on the board it said, it's all about the V. It's all about the V. See, playing Santa Claus, all about the V. All about the V. And on 9-11, 9-11, that treacherous day, two planes went into the Twin Tower, and this gentleman was telling the president at the time. But above him is this here. This face or this neck, as some people say, is in the shape of a V with two horns and the eyes look hollow, like sleepy, like death. So I don't think V is a good letter. Okay, let's look at something else. Today is 528 of 2024. On 1122 of 1963, JFK was assassinated. The difference is 60 years, six months, and six days. Yes, today Biden is gonna be speaking after the trial of Donald J. Trump, and also his surrogates will be speaking in New York. On today's date, 528 of 2024, and JFK was slain 1122 of 1963. The difference is 60 years, six months, six days, 666. Carl Rove, he said six states would determine it. Look at my hands, the number six, my fingers. Six, is he speaking without speaking? I don't know, stay tuned, I'm French Shot Pearson. Welcome to French Shot Blue. Just don't look good, whatever they got to say or whatever happens. Plus, that's close to a Phoenician Tiffany blue tie. My lord. 